Okay, so one of the first features I wanted to show you was Note. This is found on the first dashboard. It's the first icon that appears. And basically what it does is it opens up our whiteboard solution. So down here, I can select a different background setting, depending on what environment I'm in. We can also, for education purposes, drop in a, a musical sheet, handwriting, mathematics and calligraphy. But I'm going to take it to a whiteboard and it gives us full sort of pen functionality. So what we can do is open up um, a pen or a paintbrush and we can select the width of the pen that we need. We can select our colour from the full spectrum here or we can use primary colours. So basically it allows me to, to annotate and get a discussion going straight out of the box. What I can do is also make a palm quite simply and erase that content where I see fit. Or I can just sweep clean and add a new page. What we could also do is add in shapes. If we wanted to make like a, a flowchart uh, kind, of, kind of thing, and I'll, I'll select the colour again because we're on white. I can make a flowchart. and we can really, hopefully, get that discussion going. And it gives us the ability to, to also drop in content. So this screen has a USB pen um, drive on the side, so I can plug in a USB pen with any content that I wanted to bring. So I simply select Import, I select USB, and I can drop in any content, any files, any images that we want to do, and I can continue to do that depending on what's on my USB pen. So here it's very Iyama centric because I'm showing you an Iyama presentation. But it's a really nice sort of uh, feature. I can actually, if you treat this as a, a digital flip chart, we can add pages as and when we want to, and I can flip back to those pages. So what this will now allow me to do is to, to save it. Or well, the great thing I can do now, because we have a Wi-Fi adapter built into the screen, I can share this content um, to a predetermined cloud drive. So I simply go to cloud storage, I can add my account, whether it's Google Drive or OneDrive, and I can share the content there. So that hopefully takes you nicely through Note.